Hello again. This is Nick Roach. We're outside again, sunny evening. We're going to hear the birds in the background probably. They get quite loud sometimes, excuse me. I'd like to entitle this talk Don't Concentrate on the Finger or you'll miss all that heavenly glory. Now people may recognise that from a movie 1973 by Bruce Lee, Enter the Dragon. Don't concentrate on the finger or you'll miss all that heavenly glory. It was an early scene in the movie where Bruce Lee is teaching a student the correct mindset, the correct state of mind when performing martial arts. And Bruce said, it's like a finger pointing to the moon. And his student looks at the finger and confused and Bruce slaps him. Don't concentrate on the finger or you'll miss all that heavenly glory. It occurred to me that all spiritual teachings, all teachers, are the finger that are pointing. And yet, sadly, the majority of people seem to focus, concentrate on the finger. The groups, the forums, people are discussing what are the correct words one should use. So that teacher uses that word and that word, and that's not correct because that means that. And they don't talk about that. And they use that word to be something else. And that word's wrong. And what about that? They haven't used that word. That it's the finger. They're arguing about the finger that's doing the pointing. It's not quite straight enough. The, the nails haven't been painted properly, or have been painted or shouldn't be, haven't been cut properly. It's not the point. The point is the thing that's being pointed to. As Bruce Lee said, it's like a finger, a finger pointing to the moon. The words are pointers. Every teacher, every teaching is pointing to one's own nature, one's own being inside. We know that. Whatever one wishes to call it, however one describes it, it's always inside the individual. You can't feel it out there somewhere. Spiritual teachers and teaching do not point out there somewhere, they always point within. It's a spiritual teaching, it's about the spirit, which is one's own nature, the original being, the original state. So all teachers and teachings point to the same place. And yet people get hung up on the words used question, analyse, debate the words. And one can spend their whole life reading every book, every teaching, about every teacher that's ever lived, analysing, scrutinising it, and you can then learn all the books off by heart if that's your way, and have be able to write your own books about their books. You can do that. But if you're not connecting within, then you've missed the point. If you only connect within and don't understand a word they say, then you've got the point. Don't concentrate on the finger. And in this case, 
the heavenly glory is the aspect, is, is the fact, it's the truth. That's what happens. The being within is the one being behind everything, creating everything that exists. It is the heavenly glory, which then becomes normal when one's in it. But compared with the little thinking, feeling, mind and imagination, it is he heavenly glory. And yet the mind, the thinking, the emotional, unhappy self will focus on the words and analyse them and pick them to bits and debate with other people as to who's using the right words. Feel within. That's where all the words are pointing. If you want to then say to someone, you're using that word, and to me that the word means something else, absolutely fine. But do it from the position of feeling within. And also do it with the knowledge that to someone else the word might mean something different. They may have had different un experiences, be taught something at different. And as so many people use the words interchangeably anyway, consciousness and awareness, to me I use them as one and the same. And people might be going mad, you can't do that, they're not the same thing. I'm in the state, do well, I care what you call it? At some point in the future I might decide they do mean something different. But it doesn't matter. You might decide the words, you prefer other words to the ones I'm using. That's fine. They're then yours. You use your words. But don't get hung up on the words themselves. The point is the space, the awareness, the being, the I am, the stillness. Don't concentrate on the finger. Thank you.